to my channel if you're new here my name is izzy and my dad and i are <laughs> we are doing a four slash five day road trip we just landed in la today and we are currently road tripping down to san diego and then we're starting down there and road tripping slowly over the next few days up back to la and staying in a different hotel every night along the way back so um yeah so so far we are probably two thirds of the way to San Diego. We've been taking the Pacific Coast Highway, so it's like all along the water the whole way. Um, kind of checking out all the little towns that we're gonna be staying in over the next few days. And it's just been a nice relaxing drive. We have no plans while we're here. We just have our hotels booked and nothing else. So it's just been kind of nice to check all this out. And we're in Oceanside right now, which is super, super cute. Are just arriving in downtown San Diego and we're about to check into our first hotel for the trip. Okay, checking in. We're staying at the US Grant Hotel in downtown LA. Dad's comfy in his bed already. Um, you can kind of still see outside a little bit. This is the bathroom. I've already started doing my makeup and I'm gonna do a couple curls in my hair just so I look a little more presentable. But it looks nice, like they've got Byredo products, which I wish I could steal, but they're not travel sized. Um, and this is where we are. We're right downtown. We're really close to like the gas lamp district, which I guess has like lots of good restaurants and stuff. So we're gonna just kind of walk around and see what we find for dinner. Okay, outfit of the night, hair and makeup is done. So little tops just from Zara, and so is this little scarf. It's actually like a scarf, but I just tied it like a necklace. Jeans are Linus. These ones are way too big for me. I really need to get them taken in, but I just have not yet. Um, and my shoes are also from Zara. And this is from Forward, I'm just borrowing it, but it is a little Bottega bag. It's kind of like a little greenish color. Really cute for spring. So it's an Italian spot. First course, Caprese salad. Okay, we're back to the hotel. We had a quick little, like, whatchamacallit? nightcap in the hotel lobby we had i had a dirty martini it was actually excellent i took a pic i will show you the pic because i took no video content in the hotel lobby bar but um yeah it was really good and now we're going to bed and we're gonna have a very full wholesome day back to the tomorrow so we'll see you then good morning it is like 8 30 a.m i just got up and changed into some clothes to go walk and go get coffee. I think that's kind of our first movement of the day. And then I'm not sure if we're going to go for like a walk slash run. That was maybe a plan. Or if we're just gonna like head back towards like La Jolla, go for walks and spend more time over there. Haven't totally figured it out yet, but we will. My hair went a little bit crazy. I slept on it, but that's all right. You can hear the construction. That's what woke us up this morning. <laughs> Hotel's really nice, bed's really comfy, but the construction on the street, not it. Okay, we packed up our room and got our little car and we're gonna go for a walk. At the, the light, beach now. turn left onto Ash Street, then turn right onto First Avenue. Um, yeah, we're gonna go down to Pacific Beach and do a little walk along the boardwalk and I'm ready for another coffee and then we're gonna head to La Jolla for breakfast, but it's go nice to see light. everything in the day. Then at the next one, Light today and right. the sun is trying to come out, so we're hoping for better weather this afternoon. Just strolling along Pacific Beach and it's really cold as you can see by my fully zipped up jacket and it's still very cloudy today. taunting the seal. <laughs> oh, he wants it. <laughs> Get it. <laughs> see, smart you are, seal. Probably a fly around the corner. Poke me in the eye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Again. We are in La Jolla. We just stopped in and got a little coffee and we just had a little lunch and then there's a spot that I want to shoot. It's like this really cute surf shop so my dad's going to take some pics for me. He's really good at it. Um, and then we're going to head out. This is the cute little surf shop. It's called Hermosa. Hermosa Surf and they have like lattes and stuff too so I just took some photos right here. Okay, our next stop is La Jolla Cove. We want to see the seals. There's lots of, apparently it's baby seal season so we're going to stop in 
and have a little peek. There's lots of people looking over the cliff, so I have a feeling there's a lot of them. Look at all them. There's so many. Just checking in to our room for the night. We're at the Fairmont Grand. Fairmont Grand? Yeah, Fair Fairmont Grand Del Mar. This is our little view. There's a really nice golf course nearby. Chris would be excited if he was here. Yeah, it's such a pretty hotel. The lobby was stunning too. Okay, just got changed. I'm wearing this pretty set tonight. I wish there was a sunset, but again, we're not gonna get one tonight. The set is Arkina, Arkina Ori. I think that's how you pronounce the brand's name. It's like a long skirt and a matching little top, and I'm wearing the same shoes as last night because they're cute and comfy. Okay, I just took a bunch of pics out here. This area is so pretty. There's like little tea lights. It kind of looks like Tuscany vibes. Just took some pickies. This hotel is literally stunning. Everything, every detail is so pretty. All the lighting, all of the little fireplaces, and there's lots of fountains and stuff. Like, look at this place. I'm insulted that Dad's eating these oysters with a fork. They look really good, though. Okay, so we're back at our room. We had dinner at the hotel, which was really good. We weren't sure. The menu was kind of limited, but the food was really, really good. So we're happy that we went there. We had oysters and I had fish and dad had pork chop, I made some wine, and just finished the night with a little cheeky martini. Not as good as the martini I had last night. That one was bomb. Um, and now I'm just making a little chamomile tea and then I'm gonna jump in bed, have a nice little snooze. This morning we were kind of woken up to the sound of construction on the street in downtown San Diego, but here we're literally on a golf course in like, this is more like in kind of like inland towards like the hilly mountainy kind of area in Del Mar. And it's so quiet here. I think we're just gonna sleep so, so well. It's gonna be great. I lied, I'm having berry tea, not chamomile. And look at the color. It's literally very, berry. Just taking my makeup off, getting ready for bed. Um, the plan for tomorrow is, I guess just probably going to have another little chill morning. Probably wake up at like 8. And I think, so we're heading to Laguna tomorrow. We're staying in Laguna tomorrow night. Um, so we'll probably just meander our way up there. But we were kind of kicking ourselves because tonight our server was telling us how great it is just south of the border. Because if you don't know, San Diego is like really close to the border of Mexico. And he was telling us about all these little towns that are just south of the border and like all these good restaurants and stuff to go to and we were like, oh, why didn't we do that? We're so close to the border. Could have just gone to Mexico for a couple of days, but we did not this trip. So I will be going back at some point. But um, yeah, the plan tomorrow is just to kind of like meander up to Laguna. It's actually supposed to be sunny tomorrow. So we're going to shoot some sunset content um, at the beach and yeah, tomorrow will be more of like a beachy day and will actually be warm and it's just going to be so great to feel the sunshine. Oh, it's dark. Oh yeah, okay. Just go. <laughs> Every time you change the channel, it gets completely dark. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm just going to watch some TV and I'm having my little chamomile tea. And we're going to go to sleep. See you guys in the a.m. Good morning. Um, I clearly just woke up. Well, I just got up. It's um, Friday today now. And, okay, the sun went behind a cloud now, but it is sunny today. I'm so excited to report that it is sunny and I can see some blue sky because your girl needs a sunset photo shoot today. We may do. We got some cute pics yesterday. Oh, it's dark. Um, in the set that I was wearing last night, which I love that outfit so much. And we did get some cute photos, so I'm happy about that. But if we had a sunset last night, it just would have made the photos like that much more epic. So anyways, very happy to see the sun today. I actually brought workout stuff on this trip. So I'm gonna go do a quick little workout. I think my dad and I both are. He just went to take a call. And then, yeah, I need to find coffee first though. I'm gonna go find coffee. Look, the sun, it's back out. Workout complete. They have a really nice gym here, like brand new equipment and everything. So I had a nice little Stairmaster and did some like cables and stuff. Now I'm gonna jump in the shower um, and then we're 
probably gonna pack up and hit the road pretty soon. And we're headed to Laguna today, which I'm really excited about. It was our favorite place so far, like driving through all the little towns since we took the Pacific Coastal Highway the whole way, like we took very much the scenic route. So we got to like pop in and kind of have a little look-see through all of the towns and Laguna, I think was our favorite. So I'm excited to go back there and spend the day in the sunshine and hit the beach later. Okay, we were just checking out outfit of the day top and skirt are actually from Zara. It's like a little slip, split top and then wearing these platform sandals. This is the vibe. We are back on the road and it's such a different vibe today because we have the full sunshine, blue sky. Everything just looks way prettier. Um, we're slowly gonna make our way to Laguna Beach and there's this diner we saw on the way here. It's like this super retro diner. If you're from this area, you're probably really familiar with it because I think there's a bunch of them, but it's called Ruby's Diner and it just looked really cool. So we might eat there today and if not, probably tomorrow, but that's kind of where we're meandering over to now. Okay, we're pulling in to our next staycation spot of the night, which is the Ritz Carlton. It looks bougie AF, we're excited. Okay, we quickly checked in and then we're back out and we're at the diner now. We're gonna have our burgers. <laughs> Got the burgs, they have gluten-free buns. This looks really good actually. That's a regular bun. Dad enjoyed his milkshake. <laughs> entered our food coma era but we're meeting a friend for a drink now so we're at the surf and sand hotel which is really nice it actually reminds me a lot of malibu beach inn which i stayed at last time i was in la like this time last year it's so pretty here right by the water i love i love it and it finally doesn't feel cold and the sun is coming out it's so good Okay, we're just heading down to get some content now. Our resort is seriously like so beautiful. Look at that. The view. So that's our hotel up there. So sun. Just down at the beach. Literally waiting for the sun to drop beneath these clouds. I feel like we've been waiting for it for freaking hours. But it's so, so pretty here. There's my little photographer. Always on his phone. <laughs> He's so cute. Here she finally comes, the little bitch. Been waiting for you all day, miss. Dad is literally taking pictures of flower bushes right now. <laughs> He's so cute. Did you get the shot? Yeah, I got a good one. Oh no, not the flash. got the content this is the view now sadly that line of clouds never went away but i think we still got some good photos this is the resort right now it's so stunning okay we're ready for dinner i'm vlogging on my phone for a hot minute because my camera is charging this is the outfit i shot down at the beach this little set it's so freaking cute like look at all the little butterfly details on it wearing the same blazer purse and shoes as last night we are at a little steakhouse in our hotel it's so dark you can't even see but the food looks really good i got duck dad got sea bass okay we're back from dinner and the food is really good change into my robe. We're gonna go down and have a little hot tub because that's something we have not done yet on this trip. Figured it was time. I love a hotel with good cozy slippers. Well, I forgot to take my camera to the hot tub, but it was actually so nice. It was so warm. Just like a nice way to put your body to sleep, kind of. See, so yeah, I'm just getting ready to jump in bed now and we might watch a movie or something before we pass out. And then tomorrow is the last full day of our trip and we're heading to LA. We're staying in West Hollywood tomorrow, which I'm really excited about. will be like a slightly different change of pace. So that will be kind of fun, but we're gonna get up and kind of do the same routine this morning, except for be a little bit more efficient. 
Um, I won't be washing my hair, so we'll be a bit faster at getting out of here, but we're gonna get up and get coffee and then go do like some kind of workout, whether it's like a long walk on the beach or like a run or something, and then slowly make our way north. Makeup is off, teeth are brushed, hair is up, PJs are on. See you guys in the morning. Good morning. I'm having my little morning coffee at this restaurant that we sat at last night before it opens. I want to take some photos here, but it is such a beautiful, perfect day today. I'm so happy about it. I'm just wearing this really cute little PJ set from a company called Ibu Intimates. They have really cute stuff. Just took my little pics with a towel on my head and I'm gonna drink our coffee on this little balcony and then probably go do a little workout. There's dad, that's our little spot. <laughs> I walked all the way to the end of the beach and back. Such a nice little stroll. It's actually warm outside. I'm not wearing a sweater and it feels great. Just curling my hair to get the day started. Um, we're gonna head out. There's this place that was recommended to me for brunch in Laguna. So we're gonna go there and grab some food um, and check out and then make our way towards LA. Okay, we're back on the road. We're gonna go find a breakfast spot. I was recommended this place called Driftwood that's like right on the water. I think it's at a different resort. So we're gonna go try that one first and see how we do. Just got down to Driftwood. We got a table, the best table, right on the beach. Food and drinks look so good. Ice cream. <laughs> All right, we're checked into our hotel. We're staying at One Hotels in West Hollywood and it's just kind of been a journey um, checking in. I, th I, f I was under the impression we had a balcony, so I was like planning to shoot this really stunning dress on the balcony. We do not have a balcony. There were no rooms left with a balcony. Our windows are great and like the view is really pretty, but then all of a sudden <laughs> my dad's taking photos for me and there's some, some building on fire in the distance and you can, <laughs> the smoke, my dad's like, you better hurry up and take your photos because the smoke's about to block your view. Let me just show you the smoke. It's like actually something is seriously on fire and that's probably an issue. I can't see flames from, oh yeah, I can see flames. Oh my God, dad, I can see flames. Yeah, show them. Holy crap. I don't know what that is, but something's on fire. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to zoom in far enough, but on the like right hand side of that little tiny, tiny building, you can see, oh yeah, see, look, you can see the flames. Oh my God, I don't know what that is. Anyway, shooting today is not really going my way. And I feel like that's the end of the sunset because I think it's super smoggy and it just didn't really turn that yellow. So that's probably it. But I think I still want to go down to the pool and try to take a view with the smoke. Okay, we got a few photos done. Um, didn't turn out quite as expected, but I think they were still kind of cute. We struggled through. Um, and the rooftop patio like restaurant here is closed for a private event. So the odds just were not in our favor today, but I love the stress so much. So I just wanted to push through anyways. And I might try to get some more photos of it at dinner. It's Danielle Guzio, and I love her. And I'm, I changed into my sneakers, so I'm probably gonna wear those for now, because the other heels, as cute as they are, are not this piece of hair. They're not like the most comfortable. And also I'm worried people are gonna think that I'm like <laughs> a prostitute or something, because I'm so much taller than my dad and I'm wearing like this fancy dress and heels. Anyways, there's been some looks, so we're just avoiding that situation. I'm gonna bring the heels in case I find another cute spot to shoot, but. Um, yeah, anyway, we're headed to dinner now. We are eating good tonight. Oh. We're having dessert. Dig into it. Get in there. No, dig in. Do it. Do it. Get it. Looks really good, actually. Cool. 
This place was a vibe. Okay, we're back at the hotel. Jumped in bed, face washed, teeth brushed, everything. Um, that restaurant was really cute. The food was really good. We had that seafood platter that was awesome. And the dessert that dad had looked really good too. And I had their homemade gelato. It was called the Ivy um, in Beverly Hills. It was very, very cute. And lots of good spots around there that we drove by too. Um, but yeah, we're off to bed and tomorrow is our last day. So we're gonna pack in as much as possible before we have to head to the airport. Good morning. It is Sunday today, last day. Um, we're just putting on our cozies to go for a walk and get some coffee because it's just not very warm up today and it's kind of cloudy still. It's supposed to burn off, but it's still a bit cloudy, so we're dressing for the weather. Okay, we got our coffee, we went to the gym. I did like a little 12, 3.30 workout, showered, got changed. This is my outfit of the day. I'll show it to you in the mirror so you can see it properly. Wearing little cargo pants, this little black top. The pants are Lioness, they're my current favorite cargo pants. They're super oversized, it's one size fits all I guess, so you just have to tighten them as much as possible. And my little platform gazelles. And I'm gonna need a jacket because it's not very warm today, but this is the outfit. And we're gonna go check out of our hotel now. We just arrived at a brunch spot, we got a table and we just ordered, it's called Dialogue, it's really cute. Brunch was tasty and healthy. Would recommend, it's called Dialogue. And now we're just gonna walk around on Melrose for the next like 45 minutes and then we gotta head to the airport. We stumbled upon the cutest farmer's market. They have so much good stuff, like all kinds of produce and flowers and everything. It's amazing. If I lived here, I would come every Sunday. That was the Reformation store. I always go in there when I come here because they have like the cutest little vintage finds. Um, but I don't really have room in my suitcase this trip to buy anything, so nothing for me today. Okay, we're back in the car. We're heading to the airport. We're just getting, that's just stopping to get gas. Um, we're just gonna head to the airport and drop off our rental car. It's so sad, I feel like it went by so fast. And of course today is like the nicest day so far. It's the warmest, <laughs> but that's how it goes sometimes. Didn't even show you guys the car before, but this was our trusty little ride. Just dropping it off now. By the way, the rental car company we use is called Sixt, S-I-X-T, and they were really awesome, and they have like nice, kind of like slightly higher end cars, would recommend. That's the one. Okay, well that brings us to the end of our trip. Anything you wanna, anything you wanna, oh. Father-daughter trip, Love best you. ever. We're gonna try to do these, we decided at least every five years. Cause two it's years. Been, yeah, every two years. We're actually seeing each other next weekend, which is good, because we're going to Whistler, but thank you guys for watching. I hope this tri trip was useful in case you ever want to do a California road trip. It was a little bit sporadic, but um, we had a great time. And awesome. make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any other vlogs, and we'll see you next time.